So as a large computing company, you might expect that NVIDIA would be interested in quantum computing. But in fact, the association goes much deeper than that. It's really in NVIDIA's DNA to care about quantum computing because we have a long history of enabling computing revolutions. NVIDIA is not trying to build quantum hardware. We're not trying to build qubits. We're not trying to build a quantum processor. But we are trying to build a device that will turn those qubits into a useful quantum computer. And we call that device an accelerated quantum supercomputer. Query is based in Boston, and we make quantum computers using neutral atoms. Starting at the very low level, quantum computing requires error correction, requires measurement, and then very fast decisions on what to do with the measurement. These decisions can be done by classical hardware, like GPUs. An accelerated quantum supercomputer is a device that integrates quantum hardware with AI supercomputing. And you need AI supercomputing to solve the big scaling challenges that quantum computing faces. Challenges like error correction, control, and calibration. The second area that quantum and classical meet is in the area of simulation. Before people run software on a quantum computer, they often like to simulate it to make sure that it works. Simulation has always been a critical tool for developing computer hardware. NVIDIA GPUs undergo tens of thousands of simulations during their design. And it's a tool that will be just as, if not more important, in designing better quantum hardware. So really, classical computers are instrumental or vital in all stages of the quantum development, all the way from the hardware up to software development and running the algorithms. Quantinium is uh, basically a company which does quantum hardware as well as quantum software and algorithms. One key part of quantum computing is developing software. And you can see, people always talk about a million qubits. Writing software for a million qubits is not easy. Software is just as important as hardware, and that's why we've built CUDA-Q. CUDA-Q is our software platform that allows users to seamlessly both access and control large-scale accelerated quantum supercomputers. Where NVIDIA is really useful is they also provide libraries, okay, which run on GPUs. So in the software development flow, as long as we need to develop software for quantum computers, you will have to have the NVIDIA technology there to develop those scaled qubits, and then you scale it to a larger number of qubits. Right? So we use it extensively in our development internally. I've seen what GPUs have been able to do in the last 25 years, and I think the next stage of adding quantum to this is going to bring all kinds of new uh, advances to science and to people. It's become clear that to be useful, qubits need to be brought inside accelerated quantum supercomputers. That's why at NVIDIA, we're building them.